Ooh, doggy. Another hot one out. A little non-farming day today. Then we got Jeff over here. I think he's pushing one fence post. Oh no, it's pretty big. Pretty big chunk. <laughs> All kinds of old junk out here. It's an old Argo. Too much equipment in the yard right now. Have to weasel our way out. So we're headed out with the swather again. This last couple weeks have been ridiculously nice as far as the weather. It's been high 20s, low 30s for like 10 days now. So a lot of the crops have advanced. Much further along than they would be at this point. So we're just heading down the road because there is some wheat ready. Wheat ready. There's some wheat ready to swath. Beautiful field of wheat. Thought you were gonna keep going. Oh, sir! <laughs> you were getting your money shot. Yeah. How's it looking? Holy shit! That's a wonderful crop. It looks really good. Really that's good. good. There's so much there. It's just solid. Like, it's yeah, solid. it looks nice. It looks absolutely fantastic. I just I can't get over how like cured it is. I bet you thirty percent, forty percent of this field is. It's ready to combine. The long range is absolutely nuts. It's 32 degrees next week. Oh, really? Wow. Uh, <laughs> Can't measure that small. I hate, yeah, measuring in inches always when I count the digits, it messes my brain up. Uh, you could probably eyeball it. Yeah, right to there. This is what blew up. More or less. Mm, probably a little more. Yeah. It's basically to the bottom anyway. A little cockeyed. Yeah, why is it cockeyed? Well, that thing... Swivels, It'll straighten right? itself out, yeah. Yeah. Got our new part in this beast. New parts, I guess. Replacement knives. Nice and shiny, new bearing, new knife slash bearing holder arm unit. I think that's what it's called. However, I don't think we'll try it out today. Save that for tomorrow. Well, this 
would be a good field to test it on, I guess. Peas, rough. Yeah, do you want me to go spray or what? Uh, well, let's give the peas a whirl here. Okay. Yeah, they're pretty low down, eh? Yeah. Combining peas. Some of them aren't bad. Standing up like this. A few peas in there. But a lot of them are laying down like this. Which uh, just means we may have a few peas left behind. Just because we don't want to scrape the ground for them to fill the combine with dirt. But the peas uh, aren't very good in general. So Chef's not happy with peas right now. He says every year he is excited to grow them and then when it's time to harvest, he kicks himself. Wondering why he grew peas. Just gonna unload this latest bunch of Jeff's auction purchases. Some pretty good stuff in here, you know? New metric set of wrenches, brand new, awesome. Also included is a not so brand new Motorola cell phone for your car. Most people probably have never seen one of these, but it's a car phone. Pretty sweet. Nice. Another great auction purchase by Jeff. Jeff's continuing on these peas. He's having the time of his life. I am going to go and spray some wheat. Refilling time. Phil guy ready to finish desiccating this wheat just getting home from desiccating that wheat looks like Jeff is still working on these peas he's somewhere in this cloud of dust on a more positive note uh, the sunflowers are coming out And he is getting a few peas. A lot of grasshoppers as well, it looks like. And I wonder what this header is going to look like after he's done here. Yikes. So that is actually Randy combining peas. Jeff had to go home for bedtime with the boys. It's probably good. I don't think he was having the best time with those peas. So I'm just gonna fill the sprayer up for him so he can go spray later tonight. 